and the person I got is kind of perfect. Uh, I think he's a little bit of a nerd, even more so than me, which is great. I love that. Uh, stays to himself. I can tell he doesn't have a girlfriend. Uh, his nationality happens to be white, not that that matters, but uh, we both have similar interests, which I think helps in this situation. I think it helps a lot. But all I gotta do is get another person on board that goes well with that scenario second. If I could just get one more person on board with our same similar interests, again, I will have, I will be rent free. So that is my goal. And we're halfway to, we're halfway done with 2023. So my main concern is to focus on my online business. And I found a lot, I mean a lot of new apps, if you want to call them that, websites that will assist you in doing a faceless YouTube channel. Now, why do I want to build a faceless YouTube channel? It's not for the reasons you think. Even though I am an introvert, as an introvert, I don't have a problem doing videos like this because I'm not talking to a person. I'm talking to a camera. So I don't have any issues with doing videos where I show my face. I obviously don't have low self-esteem, at least at this point in my life. So I have no worries about showing my face on videos, but I want to appeal to a greater audience, a wider audience, whatever you want to call it, and the only way to do that is to stay completely neutral with a faceless YouTube channel where nobody knows what I look like, who I am, it'll probably be a cartoon design logo, and I'm probably going to want to stay in the area of technology because I could get a lot more affiliate dollars, I believe. And I'm just going to go down the line and each week do probably on average one long form video, three shirts. So for every long form video, I found a software that can turn that into many different videos. So if you have a 20 minute video, just plug it in that video, just the YouTube link. And this website will spit out titles already, short form videos, or a shorter long form video. Um, and it already have the titles, it already have the words going across the screen. Uh, what you're saying so it generates all that and basically all you got to do is download it and put the video up so I'm going to experiment with that so you, you're going to see you might see changes on the videos on the uh, upcoming videos but it's going to be to enhance my performance so all my eight all my videos be AI, but you won't know they're AI because they'll be videos of myself. Now, if that ain't amazing, I don't know what is. Literally, I will have AI generate videos of myself and you won't know it was generated by AI. You'll just think it was just edited footage. That is where we are right now in this. It's not in the future, it's now. faceless channel I'm working on I'm not going to let you guys know about uh, unfortunately I'm not going to let my current audience on any of my channels 
know about this new channel because like I said, I wanna to appeal to a wider audience. Those videos will be 100% AI generated on the new Faceless channel. But I'm talking about going forward on my current channels, you're gonna see a lot of AI generated videos of me. Now I'm just taking long form footage and it's gonna like clip shorter videos again with the titles um i don't not know yet if it's gonna be able to help me with thumbnails i gotta check into that but i'm gonna play around with that today and see what i can come up with because again uber and lyft is just not it um anybody that even asked me about should i do uber and lyft i probably would tell you no but but, there is a but. Give me one sec, let me get a drink. <coughs> but, there will be uh, there will be times where you'll be able to do this stuff And literally, in the future, you'll be able to just input a title and software will just spit out a whole video completely done. Like, I think we're moving towards that and right now. But the but I was going to get at, too, is I would tell people not to do Uber and Lyft, but transportation is not dead. It ain't that I agree with the rideshare professor, the Uber tuber rideshare professor. I agree with him when he says going private is the only true way you can make money using the Uber platform to kind of set yourself up like a private limousine chauffeur service and steal their customers on Uber Black and XL. I believe it's a great strategy. I don't care if you buy Ryan Professor's course. If you buy his course, a course that I'm thinking about creating, whatever you need to do, do it. Because I truly believe that's the only way to make money, I, again, using the Uber platform now here's the good thing, as far as I know, you only gotta do actually one Uber Black trip a month to keep your status. I would recommend doing a little bit more than that. I probably would do probably like maybe five, five to six rides a day. I obviously gotta get the vehicle. I have the insurance company in mind. So I do have an insurance company of mine. So I am gonna stay in transportation and probably eventually move to the Uber Black platform. But Uber X, not gonna work. Um, if if uh, Lyft Lux is still around, or whatever they call their high tier, Lyft Black, whatever they call it, I probably will be doing that as well. But that's only to get their customers. I can care less about staying on the platform. So I probably will do whatever is required to stay in their good graces just long enough to get enough private clients really to only make two, three hundred dollars a day. I'm not trying to get rich in transportation because ultimately my goal is not to get rich in transportation. Ultimately, ultimately my goal is to get rich online with online sales and use my online sales money to fuel my transportation slash rental business because I probably will end up renting cars in the future to Uber and Lyft drivers. Now, a lot of you might be thinking, well, why would I do that if I'm not interested in doing Uber and Lyft? Because it's still a lucrative rental business that is 
kind of a it's a high risk business but <coughs> it's a high risk business but it gives me the ability to write off a lot you can write off a lot with anything in transportation so there'll be the mother load of write off so all the profits I'm going to make from the online money because you're, you're you tend to make a lot more money online. If you can pull off a good online business, you're gonna make more profits because there's no overhead. Obviously, the transportation business is gonna have a lot of overhead and it has a lot of risk. But if you do this right, under a holding company structure, probably where the media company slash software business is going to be the holding company and then you have an operating company that is your transportation business you now have the means to write off uh, offset your profits from write-offs that you got in your transportation business now I'm not a licensed professional you do have to check with your accounting or your accountant or CPA, but it's safe to say if it sounds like it makes sense, it makes sense. And transportation is a high risk business, therefore, you're going to give it a low risk name, and I'll still better generate corporate credit on both entities the holding company as well as the transportation company. So, that's one of the great things about doing this, guys. Want to have a you want to have a holding company and an operating company. Your holding company, preferably, they tell you your holding company should not do business with the general public. Preferably. So what I may do because the YouTube, even though it has a little risk doing YouTube, because if I say the wrong thing, I could get sued, but it's not likely. I may just have my media company hold the revenue from the YouTube channels and I might do a separate LLC for the streaming platform. I haven't decided yet. I really haven't decided yet. But either way, you gotta have a holding company. Now I currently have a holding company that was set up wrong. I talk about it all the time. Um, it was set up by E. Dean Cole, the scammer. I did that video with him and Troy. I might link that below this video too, because that video is doing well. People want to know about the, the, these two scammers, E. Dean Cole and Troy Mason. But E. Dean Cole set up. E. Dean Cole set up my initial holding company. He over promised and under delivered, but I do have a holding company in Navy Federal. Uh, that's where I put the bulk of my affiliate money. So that's the affiliate marketing company. So any company that I join, like Pick3 AI or anything like that that I'm promoting with an affiliate link, that goes to my current holding company that pays me a check. That's what pays me. My Uber and Lyft money goes in there. Everything goes in there currently. But I want to start a brand new holding company for the media stuff. Because I know going in the future, I want to have, hopefully, turn it into a escort. Hopefully, after to make some money. And I may want to sell that platform. I'm never going to sell my current holding company. But I may sell the new holding company in the future because it's going to be very valuable. It's going to have several operating companies that are all eventually going to make money. I'm thinking about doing a private member club in the future that doubles as an event space. Yeah, all the stuff y'all heard me talking about in the past, in the last year, I haven't given up on that stuff. I'm still working on that stuff, but AI technology has really improved the 
process. Because Glenn and Cameron will tell you that this stuff to start a successful YouTube channel is going to take, you know, easily three years, three to five years. He says that all the time, and he's right. Except for what AI technology can speed that process up. AI technology, I'm not bullshitting, you could rapidly speed that process up. Because it makes generating videos not necessarily easier, but more productive. And uh, software like ChatGPT, you don't even have to come up with the titles, guys. You can literally go to ChatGPT and be like, give me 10 titles based on just your description you have for your YouTube channel. It'll give you 10 titles, guys. This is like a dream for me, guys. I'm not a nerd. I was never smart in high school. I was never an athlete or a nerd. I'm kind of like in the middle, you know. I never was necessarily a thug. But I'm in my 50s, guys, and I'm learning this stuff, and it's getting easier, not harder. Do you hear what I'm saying? Learning this stuff is getting easier, so there's no excuse. <coughs> there's absolutely no excuse why you guys can't do a Facebook YouTube channel. Now. What's your excuse? You got software to do the script. You got software to do the titles. You have excellent voiceovers. Guys, I could do a YouTube channel where I'm probably gonna do future voiceovers in my own voice. And the reason for that is I, the people that relate to me, they relate to me because of me. So what I wanna do is Duplicate my voice, and my voice will be the voice you're going to hear on my current channels. The only channel I need a new voice for will be my Faces YouTube channel. So I'm going to be, I'm going to have several AI platforms I'm using. I'm going to have to spend a little money. Let's keep it real. Um, the AI software that does the it, the great voiceovers, it does, and you can get it for free. But for me to duplicate my voice, it is going to cost money. Um, for me to duplicate my voice, but I believe it'll be well worth it because that little thing right there alone is going to change the game for my YouTube content, guys. I'm telling you gonna change the game and then on my faceless channel all I gotta do is just pick a voice that sounds the most realistic and even though pick three has great videos I may have to go to another source to get some different video content for the channel so I'm working on that but um, if you guys honestly I'm an open book. I'm gonna be real with you guys. I'm an open book, and if you seriously want to learn this stuff and see everything I'm doing for pennies on a dollar, it's only gonna cost you $9.97 a month and get in my membership. It's called the Corporate Hustler. It's a very inexpensive membership, and you're gonna get video footage of a lot of the stuff that I'm working on. I'm gonna put it on that, in that membership, and I'm gonna put some on my Patreon as well. So, if you're in those groups, I mean, my lowest Patreon is only $3.99, guys. I mean, how much cheaper do you want me to go? You know, I have, I'm gonna have a high tier Patreon, um, 
that's $27.99 that I'm gonna have uh, some behind the scenes footage in the future. And then I'll have a lower tier on Patreon, $9.97 I believe it is. And then I think the lowest is $3.97 I believe. And the $3.97 is gonna get your basic content that you would get on the channels without commercials. The $9.97 you're gonna get more of the insider stuff that you're gonna also be able to get on my Corporate Hustler subscription. Now, another difference about the Corporate Hustler subscription that, that you don't have on the Patreon is you could get everything for, for $97 for the whole year. And just knock it out and you're saving money. And you're gonna get all my secrets. I'm putting out all my secrets. This is gonna be an ongoing subscription, probably for life, until I launch my bigger platform. I'm gonna launch an even bigger platform that I might brand under a different name. I haven't decided yet. But right now, my subscription, Corporate Hustler, you'll see a link for it under all the videos. Get in the group, share your thoughts. We can share mid-journey photos. We're gonna be able to share a lot with this subscription. I'm gonna have um, Laredo AI, I think that's how to pronounce it. Journey AI photos that I create are also going to go in that subscription. And if you're in that subscription, you better use that content. You better use those photos. I'm not restricting anybody from using those photos. So it's going to be a lot going forward. I'm working on a course. Yes, I'm working on a course that I'm gonna give away for free, for free. But if you're in the subscription, you're also gonna get that content. So you're not gonna be left out. But what you're not gonna get in the course, you're also gonna get in the, uh, a book I'm working on as well. The book, <coughs> the video version of the book is gonna be in the subscription as well. So subscription is gonna have everything. But I am going to put out a AI course for free. And what that's going to do is, I'm not going to lie, I got the idea from the camera. What that's going to do is that's going to generate my pipeline with hopefully uh, some subscribers that I can market other stuff to, like the book like the subscription and like my free streaming platform that I'm going to have in the future. So I'm working on a lot guys with all AI technology. So I'm working on a book that's going to be basically about being a corporate citizen in general. About being a, a business owner, doing all this stuff day to day um, building out your business online Using all these technologies. Now, the course is going to be more of a step by step on how to do certain things, and it's going to feature not a lot, but it's probably going to feature three to five AI tools that you could use to start your online business. And that's gonna, I'm gonna literally give that away for totally free. Totally free. And it might be, it might not be free forever, but I'm gonna give it away for free in the beginning. And then I might charge a small amount for it, probably only like $47, something like that for it in the future. As well as you're gonna start seeing me produce a lot more of my own products and services. It's not that I don't like all these other companies. It's just I don't 100% want 
I don't like that I don't get a bigger percentage. For example, network marketing. Not a bad business, but if the network marketing company goes down, I lose that revenue stream. So I'm starting to learn now that come up with my own revenue streams and then I can keep, what, 90%? You know, Stripe and PayPal will take their percentage, but I'm going to probably keep like 95% of the revenue that I generate from this stuff. That's why I'm coming up with my own products. And everything I'm talking about, there'll be links for underneath this video. So if you're interested in Pick3 AI, the link's below. Now, what I'm using for my... Uh, current subscription is PayHip. And guys, PayHip is free. You can also use this tool to come up with your own products. And I think the free tier, I think they do take like 5%, which I believe is the same thing uh, Patreon takes. But there's higher tiers when they take a smaller percentage if you decide to upgrade, but you can get by with the free version until you make like five to six hundred dollars and then you upgrade. It's just that simple. You know? So everything I'm doing, I'm talking about pay hit, pick three AI, um, all these different AIs we're talking about, and talking about AIs, uh, Microsoft Bing, I believe they're gonna integrate chat GPT-4 if they haven't already into their uh, platform. So you'll better literally go to Bing and be able to get access to chat GPT-4 without paying the extra $20 I think OpenAI is paying. I did try to BARD for Google. Not I don't, I'll be honest, BART, I don't like it as much as I like ChatGPT, the free version, 3.5. I don't like it as much yet, but they, they're saying they're improving it. Um, Google's also coming out with something called Gemini. Google's trying to destroy Microsoft before Microsoft even get off the brand. So it's a race for the AI stuff, and I love it. The reason why I love it is because the more they compete, the more products and services we have to use for building our own business. I love it. <coughs> so guys, this is not the time to be scared about losing your job. This is the time to be learning new skills to create a business that is so lucrative that if you want to take a job, a freelance job, for example, you can take it. I'm at the point right now, guys, with what I know right now, I could go on Fiverr and put up some freelance gigs and I might actually get some work. Just on the knowledge I know about logos, they even got a new AI coming out for our logos. It's already out. It's a new AI that literally, you put in a few things about your business, boom, spits out a uh, logo for you. And if you don't, if you want to make minor changes to it, you can go and edit, add changes to it. I'm purposely not telling you the name of these companies because I'm going to promote them with affiliate links. And that in itself is a whole nother online business, guys. Affiliate marketing is a whole nother business in itself. You literally can start a YouTube channel. Forget about AdSense money. Forget about AdSense money. I'm not telling you don't think about it in the future. But forget about AdSense money. Create a channel, even if it's a shorts channel. It could be all shorts. But if you are promoting the right affiliate marketing products, you will make money. I promise you, you will make money. If you want to learn more, number one, subscribe to the damn channel. 
click the link below. Click that bell icon so you get updated when I post another video. This is probably one of my longest videos I've done in a while. And um, just stay in touch, guys. Get in the subscription. What are you waiting for? It's only $9.97. Just pay the year and knock it out. $97 one time. And this is ongoing stuff. I'm not going to stop like I did with my Patreon. The, this is going to be ongoing. Everything that I'm learning, I'm going to put in this description. And when I start my own streaming platform, I will already have content to put in my streaming platform. So in the future, all my videos will be AI generated, but some of them you won't know because they'll be longer form videos that I just chopped up and made more videos. Now, how I feel about Troy Mason, obviously I'll never do business with him again, but I will say this about Troy Mason. With that black card, he created a good product. The only thing I think where Troy went wrong, he didn't stick to the product. He should have just stayed with the product itself and not focused on all this other foolery he was doing and trying to get $5,000 out of everybody for the black table idea when he knew it was shady. If he just focused on promoting his card, I believe he would be successful, but fast forward, everybody has a metal black card. Maybe not black, but everybody has a metal card. Everybody. So now, guess what, George? You're not as valuable anymore because everybody has a metal card. And now you want to try to do the spin and try to say you are sick for three years News flash, Troy, the black table was over three years ago. When they first started the black the black uh, table program, it was over three years ago. So what's your excuse now? You were sick for three years. What's your excuse now? What happened before the three years? You weren't sick and you still were taking people's money. That's all I got for this rant today, guys. I want to thank you guys that have been watching me for, you know, a few years. You know, I got a few uh, look of uh, uh, people that just like to look. They don't never comment or like. That's fine. You know, some people do that. But I want to thank everybody for at least continue to watch. Please, I want everybody to subscribe. And I'm going to catch you guys in the future content.